Tuesday the 1st of September and it is a beautiful morning here in the Lake District uh, as you saw we've got a, a stunning sunrise and uh, there's a quite a beautiful temperature inversion over there over Ulls Water it's quite usual there's been a few inversions over Ulls Water Got a bit of a, a bit of mist going over the mountain tops. Uh, that's where we're headed today. Nice long 18 kilometer route. So it's only half past six, so we've got plenty of time. Definitely going to take it nice and steady today. Uh, I was quite surprised how uh, tired I was last night. We only did eight miles. So got another four on top of that today. Uh, I didn't sleep amazingly well on and off a bit but yes I think I got enough we was in bed fairly early went to bed about half past ten as you can see there's the tents nice little spot that I think it's a a better spot than the summit in some ways due to the fact it's uh, quieter we saw a couple of people uh, passing by but uh, quite well off path so that's good so we get a a good enough pitch tonight. Right, so we just got back to Hartsop with uh, restocks on uh, food and uh, maybe a small amount of alcohol. Small, I mean it did a bit. Um, so we actually cut the route down short. We was planning on going up over Angletown, <coughs> Angletown Pikes, past Angletown to the bottom of Restod and down past Horswater Reservoir, but we didn't really have the time um, without rushing. So instead we, uh, we came down straight off Place Fell and dropped straight down and then walked round to Hartsop. So it's quarter past ten now and we've still got about a 10k route up and over uh, Dove Crag, Hart Crag, Fairfield uh, and on to St Sunday. So we're not as fit as we were and uh, I think if we'd have done the extra we'd have been pushing it for time and uh, there's no worse than getting to camp and having a, to rush around. So. We made a decision and uh, yeah, quite happy we did. So we can have another steady day and uh, plenty of breaks and just uh, enjoy the lakes and enjoy the mountains.
Fairfield. Alright, we're on Fairfield. Uh, there's somebody in the background and that's where we're headed. half an hour has been a slog. Cracking views there. How are you feeling Rich? Very tired. <laughs> so the plan is now to look for a spot to pitch and uh, then go get some water. So it's six o'clock and we've got a bit of camp kitchen on the go already. Um, it was a long day today, so once we got to uh, where we're going to pitch, uh, yeah, I needed to get some food in me. So I'm cooking, and uh, Richie's just pitching up. He's going to cook after that. I am actually pitched up. I'll just take it under. Show you quickly where um, the wind's a little bit stronger where I've pitched up, but uh, I've got the shelter for it. But it is flatter. As you can see, that's where I'm pitched. Um, up here, the wind's not as bad, so I can just come up here. It's boggy in areas and slanted, so I just preferred a, a more level pitch. So, yes, um, it looks like I'm boiling. As I was saying, uh, yes, my tea's ready now, so that takes about 10 minutes. So I'll leave that to uh, settle. Um, yeah, it was a bit of a slog today, very difficult. Um, a lot of climbing and a lot of descending. So we had plenty of breaks and uh, we've had uh, a bit of a mixed bag of weather. One minute it's been like this, bright sunshine, the next minute it's been cloudy and gusty. So, yeah, the, we checked the weather report. We got onto Hart Crag and checked the weather report, and uh, it was it had changed basically. Um, the wind had picked up earlier than we thought, so we're going to be gusting at about 40 mile an hour um, in a few hours. So we wanted to find a relatively sheltered spot. Uh, we did intend to pitch on uh, St Sunday Crag. Uh, that's right up there. So we've come off, and uh, Berks is over there. So we're uh, pitched in between St Sunday and Berks. Uh, like I say, I found uh, quite a nice little shelf away from the path and uh, nice and flat as well, which is good. So as you can see, Richie's just pitched up now. Well, it's a very good morning to you from the Lake District. And uh, as you can see, it's not a very pleasant one. So, wind picked up during the night quite heavily as forecast. Um, it was gusting into the fort, so you could feel the tent shaking a bit. Woke me up about three o'clock, rained until about four, and then I just sort of drifted in and out until uh, now, which is about six o'clock. So, Sunrise is in about 20 minutes. Me and Richard decided uh, the wind's actually going to pick up even further. It's uh, picking up into the 40s within the next hour. 
we've decided it's uh, time for us to pack up and head home. Uh, we've had a really, really nice two days and uh, we knew the weather was turning today but we thought it would be a little bit later. But uh, there you go, you can have everything. So, yes, it was a, quite a warm night even though it was uh, windy and uh, a bit of rain. But uh, I suppose we are camped a bit lower than we was. Uh, yesterday, so yes. Right, I'm gonna get packed up, and I'll uh, I'll see you on the next trip. So there are some beautiful scenes.